Good morning guys and welcome back to the Quick Spin series. I'm Scott and this is Oscar and today we're going to introduce you to the Sunliner Switch S441. Now back in February we looked at the S442 but what Sunliner does so well is they have a variety of chassis and a variety of layouts available for each design. So today we're going to be checking out the S441 it is on a Ford Transit chassis, one of their new releases. So come on, let's take a look together. The Switch S441 by Sunliner. This is on the Ford Transit rear wheel drive chassis. And here is some specs. Hit pause now if you wanna have a look. Otherwise, let's roll tape. Hey there guys. So this is the Switch S441. Now it's a different layout from the 442 that we have on order, but it's actually one of the newer models built on the option of the Ford Transit chassis. So let's check it out. Right, you can see how nicely the Ford Transit integrates into the grey body of the switch. The lines look nice. But let's head inside. Let's go and check out this cab. Right, so climbing inside, you'll see that as standard, it has this lovely 12 inch touchscreen from Ford. And plenty of other niceties, we'll get to them in a second. There's plenty of storage on top of the dashboard here. And as you turn around, you notice, as this is the 441, you have the ensuite there. So there is no swiveling seats. And if we look down, you can see there is a step up into the habitat and a large handbrake. But this has all the standard Ford gear. So let's give a quick rundown. The current generation of Ford Transit has been on the world market since around 2015. But Ford has been consistently keeping it updated, so you'll find such niceties as a 12 inch floating touchscreen with SYNC 4 capability. It gets adaptive cruise, traffic sign recognition, lane keeping assist, lane keeping departure, auto stop start, and much, much more. We're looking forward to the heated cab seats and the heated windscreen. I think that they'll be great for the overnight free camping. But if you want to see a full list, we did do a recent comparison and I'll link it up here. Now this model on display is a standard model without a sleeping Luton. So there's plenty of storage up here and you're not going to bump your head on this. But there's your habitat. So let's go and check that out. So let's head inside the habitat. You'll notice that there's the cab. We just checked that out. But right in front of us here is a pantry in the void of the ensuite. We'll open this up and I'll show you a still photo showing it in all of its glory. And then as we shut that up in the roof directly above, you'll see the air conditioning and the wonderful LED lights. This has the lowering electric bed at the rear over the club lounge. And the kitchen here has the standard folding bench to increase your bench space. And now we'll just check out some still photos showing you the layout of the kitchen. Now these cabinets seem to all be a fairly sun standard Sunliner component set, but they still look great. And then looking up, you can see all the beautiful lighting. But before I go any further, let's check out this bathroom. We'll open this door and you can see that there is a full toilet in there, cassette toilet, nice mirror, large glass, full height shower. Check that out. There's a vent in the roof with LED lighting. And here again is some still shots showing you the floor plan and layout. Now you have a club lounge at the rear, which looks super comfortable as you have the lowering electric bed from above it. And as you can see in these still photos, this is how it gets set up. And then you still have plenty of storage in the back here, large windows, and there's the TV. And then you can see here, there's the tracks for the bed to run down in. 
But yes, this is the 441. This is the, the most popular of the um, switch models, as you can see here for couples who just want the bed to go down and don't need the extra bed above the cab. Storage wise on the outside, at the front you have a small storage compartment here with a picnic table. And then under the club lounge, you'll see a secondary storage compartment. And if we shut this, beneath that you'll see a vented battery compartment right here with all the electricals and as we head around the back to the other side now on this model you got your LPG two bottles I think this is another picnic table no that's actually storage as well that's pretty cool Then you have your water tank, your outdoor shower, your gas heater. But it gives you a, an outline of what the exterior looks like with its current standard grey pack, its decals, and the Ford Transit body. So tell us what your thoughts were on the Ford Transit Switch 441. Leave your comments below and we'll see you next time.